What if I told you that the United States Army once sprayed an entire American city with bacteria? Not to protect it, but to test how vulnerable it was. This isn't science fiction. This is a real experiment. One that happened while ordinary people went about their day. Completely unaware they were part of a military simulation. It's September 1950. The Cold War is heating up. And the United States military is preparing for something they hope never happens. Biological warfare. But how do you test whether a city is vulnerable without actually attacking it? The answer, according to Army researchers, was simple. You simulate an attack. And so, Operation Sea Spray was born. Over the course of six days, Navy ships stationed just off the coast of San Francisco released a massive cloud of bacteria into the foggy morning air. The wind carried the particles deep into the city, drifting past office buildings, into open windows, and onto unsuspecting citizens. The bacteria weren't considered dangerous. They were chosen specifically because they were thought to be harmless, a stand-in for a real biological agent. What the public didn't know, the military was secretly tracking how many people got sick and how fast. Within days, hospitals began reporting an unusual spike in infections. One man, Edward Nevin, a 75-year-old, died from complications linked to the exact bacteria used in the experiment. Others suffered urinary tract infections, pneumonia, and complications that doctors couldn't explain. But the public? Still unaware, the true nature of Operation Sea Spray wouldn't come to light for more than 20 years. In 1976, declassified documents revealed the truth. San Francisco had been a testing ground and its citizens unwitting test subjects. Public outrage followed, but no one was ever held accountable. In fact, Operation Sea Spray was just one of hundreds of secret biological tests conducted by the United States government between the 1940s and 1970s. None of them required public consent. Today, Edward Nevin's family still calls for answers. And San Francisco remains the city where an invisible enemy drifted through the fog, released by the very government meant to protect it. This was Operation Sea Spray, a story you never heard of until now.